set to go then for the 2023 Betfred St. Ledger and away they go over this iconic extended 14 furlong trip and a nice break by chess piece on the outside of Denmark in the blue cap who begins to immediately serve his intentions and is alongside Gregory in the early stages should be a good pace on here chess piece in third Frankie's got a rest in fourth place with Next to the rail, the pink cap of Alexandrupolis. Continuous is taking a little bit of a grip in the early part of the race. Desert Hero looks relaxed next to the rail. And then Tower of London last but one. And Middle Earth is locked away in last place for Oshin Murphy. About seven lengths off the speed as the runners race away from the grandstands and heading down the back straight here. They're about to take the left-hand turn, which will take them through their first half mile of the contest. It's Denmark then in front for Danny Tudhope, taken on by Gregory on the inside there, Kieran Schumach. Chess piece racing in third for James Dahl as they uh, cross over Rose Hill on the far side. They're followed then by Alexandrupolis and Arrest and Frankie de Tori in fifth place under restraint arrest. On the inside then is the Royal Runner Desert Hero, Tom Marcond. And then right behind these two is Continuous and Ryan Moore. Middle Earth has just made a bit of a forward move, relegating Tower of London to last place in what looks to be a fairly generously run race so far. They've gone off pretty quickly here. It's going to be a proper stamina test as they go through the more or less the halfway stage of the contest here. So moving across the far side of Town Moor in the Betfred St. Ledger of 2023. It's still Denmark on the outside of Gregory, only a bob of the heads between them. Right behind them poised is chess piece. A length and a half away then is Alexandrupolis. And then Frankie tracking that one with a rest on the outside of Desert Hero. And then they followed them by Continuous and Tower of London and Middle Earth just being squeezed along now by Oshin Murphy as they come into view of the grandstands with five furlongs left to go. They're turning into the home straight now in the ledger. Eight lengths would cover the field. Who's going best? Out in front here is Denmark. Gregory cruising on the inside for Kieran Schumark in the red cap. Now angling for run. Alexandrupolis continuous as being asked a few questions by Ryan. Chess piece and then Frankie on the outside with the rest. Now starts to make giant strides followed by Desert Hero. And Tom Marcon just shut in slightly there. Tower of London on his outside. They're inside the final two and a half furlongs in the St. Ledger and making his bid for glory is continuous. Arrest is chasing him down in second place, followed on the outside by Tower of London, but Continuous seems to have the ledger within his grasp as they approach the final furlong. Desert Heroes plugging away back and forth, but Ryan Moore and Continuous are pouring it on in the closing stages here. Arrest and Frankie can't do anything about it, and Continuous, he's all out though, but he's going to win it really well. Takes us at ledger, number seven for Aiden O'Brien.